Not so long ago, you ate snakes and Apache gunships took your calls. But now, you enjoy fly fishing on three-day weekends and you enjoy nightly repose on your Sealy Posturepedic. You used to be an adventurer, but now you're a civilian and happy about it. If going back overseas isn't for you, here are a few clear jobs for former special ops vets and overseas adventurers to consider. If you've always wanted to be a closer, you'll get your chance as an account executive. In this career track, you'll form relationships, not with tribal councils, but with your former fellow men and women in uniform. Instead of capturing enemy strongholds, you'll identify and capture business opportunities, sealing the deal, and be home in time for dinner. You'll need the personality to pull it off and the golf swing. If you're the kind of person who knows how to get stuff from point A to point B, and you don't need someone else telling you how to do it, consider logistics. A logistics professional thrives under pressure. In defense industry logistics, this may mean getting millions of dollars of equipment overseas on a strict deadline. Those with ulcers need not apply. But if you have the attention to detail and the ability, perhaps literally, to move mountains when necessary, logistics can be a great career. If you see yourself as a future CEO, there may be no better career path to consider than program management. All great company execs started as great program managers. This is a role where your military leadership skills can shine. If you can keep teams organized, on target, and moving forward to accomplish the mission, you were a born program manager. Perhaps the best aspect of each of these careers they command top salaries, and they demand your leadership experience. It's not the same as running a platoon in Iraq, but the payoff is still high stakes, and the responsibilities are significant. If you're a veteran, you've earned your leadership stripes. Now put that experience to work as a business leader. <laughs>